how you're doing. I hope you're feeling well and everyone's doing good. Uh, and thank you again to everything you do towards my channel, the likes, shares, the comments, and all my subscribers. Thank you again. So the other day I was talking about doing an upcoming live and getting some guests on because I haven't done that yet. And uh, I noticed quite a few people in my comments were asking if I knew people like Kevin Lane and Tony Argent and people like that. Now, I do actually know Kevin Lane. I'll ring Kevin and ask if Kevin would come on my channel and do a live. And I called him up yesterday and he's agreed to come on, which was I'm really happy with. So I've got Kevin as an upcoming guest in the next few weeks. I'd imagine a lot of you would know who Kevin is. He's been on a few podcasts. He was wrongly convicted of a contract killing. He served 20 years in prison for a contract killing that he didn't commit. Um, so his book, uh, Fitted Up and Fighting Back, I've actually got it with me now. Um, his book is called Fitted Up and Fighting Back. It's probably going to be reversed because of the camera, but yeah, Fitted Up and Fighting Back, brilliant book um, by Kevin Lane. If you look at the bottom, he's got some boxing gloves down there as well. Kev was a boxer as well, and he was a, a good street fighter. He's very game. He, he's not a troublemaker, but he if he has to fight, he will. Very similar to myself. And he's had some, some big fights in the prison. He's had fights against all the screws that have come in with the shields and helmets. And uh, it's all in the book. And he had a, he had a very, very uh, well-known fight against a notorious prisoner called Gary Nelson, who was very, very feared in the jail. Um, so he's got loads of stories about that and what he's going to be doing in the future. So, yeah, Kevin will be on uh, in the upcoming weeks. Now, I met, I met Kevin, actually, through my mate Manny Clark. This was probably about probably about a year and a half ago. We all met up at Frank Bruno's house, and that's the first time I met Kev. And we all had a little meet up and uh, a few cups of tea, and got to know Kevin. And uh, yeah, he, he he sort of really made an impression on me. A gentleman, uh, old school, very polite, great demeanour, lot of charisma. Um, they called him Catwalk Kev, don't they? But yeah, really, really interesting man. And yeah, and someone I class as a friend now. So yeah, Kevin will come on soon, and yeah, I just thought I'd let you know about that. So uh, I'm also going to talk to my other good friend, Big Joe Egan. Now, I haven't asked him yet, but um, I'm sure sure Joe will pop on as well. Uh, I was meant to meet Chris Lembrianu on Thursday, but I had a training course. So I was going to talk to Chris Lembrianu as well. Uh, I'll get on very well with Chris. We're good friends too, and we keep in touch. So there's a few things, hopefully, in the pipeline I can get on for, for some little... Um, little lives and little Q&As and stuff so thank you very much for the subscribers and for everything you do I appreciate it and yeah looking forward to getting some some guests on soon all the best